Good day in Kearney for high school sports, and we still got the Fort Kearney championships, but early on today, it was the boys state dual championships in our local fours. Mason Kern has more on the semifinals. Welcome to state duels at the Buffalo County Fairgrounds in Kearney. We start in the semifinals and in Class A. Grand Island taking on Millard West, and at 150 pounds, Dane Aaron circles and gets the takedown. He earns a 12-0 major decision win for the Islanders. Now up at 285, Zachary Pittman goes to work for GI. He wins by fall, but Gish bows out of the title race in a 37-32 loss. In Class B, where nobody wants to face Husker commit Cade Ziola of Omaha Scott. Lane Wright of Kozad gets the honors at 190. Ziola impresses though in a 25-9 tech fall. The Skyhawks win the duel 46-19. But the real state duel magic here in Kearney comes in the Class C semifinals where both matches come down to the wire, finishing in the last bout and on criteria. Minden and Battle Creek going to war at 144. Nick Kreikmeyer wrestles without hands for the Indians. Impressive stuff, but Parker Hatch handles business in a 16-4 major decision win for the Whippets. Battle Creek trails by six going into the final bout, and Kaysen Kemp does the unthinkable at 106. He gets the fall to tie the duel. The place goes crazy, but it's Minden who advances on total wins. I can't even explain to you how awesome this is to do. Um, honestly, at the end of that duel, I knew we tied. I don't know what the criteria is. I'm just glad it ended in our favor. Elsewhere in Class C, Broken Bow is the three-time champs here. St. Paul trying to snap that streak. Wildcats need a win from Lane Baker at 106 to do it. And Baker is the hero. He wins an 11-7 decision to give St. Paul a 32-31 victory. Bow, they've won it three years in a row, so we keep saying, why not us? They're better than they think they are, and they, uh, they showed it to not only us, but to the rest of the state. As for Class D, it'll be Aquinas Catholic and Sutherland for the state duels title. Championship coverage to come, but for now, reporting in Kearney, Mason Kern, Local 4 Sports.